Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is Carmine Sabia for Explain America. And Hillary Clinton, she just got torn into by former Fox News host Megyn Kelly. And so did MSNBC host Rachel Maddow. Before we get started, please make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Those little things really help us out and they help our channel continue to grow. So Megyn Kelly was doing her podcast on Sirius XM. She also does a video portion of that podcast and she posts it. So Miss Kelly was talking about what happened during the hours right before the Trump indictment. Now you may remember I brought you this video right after it happened and Hillary Clinton was on the Rachel Maddow show purportedly to talk about other things. It just so happened that it coincided with the Trump indictment and Hillary Clinton sat there and she tried to say that this is a really serious thing and somber and she took no satisfaction in it. But she pretty much laughed the entire time. You could see the joy. You could see the joy. And I don't, I understand. If she was just if straight about it, if she just said we had a really tough battle for the presidency, then, you know, and, and he said lock her up and all this stuff and wanted me in jail. And now I do take some satisfaction in this. I could understand that. But this idea that she took no satisfaction of it was her face gave it away. Let's put it that way. And Megyn Kelly, well, she tore into the entire thing. Let's take a look. Can I tell you, it, that was a disgusting display by both women on the set. I would vote for Ron DeSantis over Joe Biden any day of the week. I've made that clear, okay? I, I tell you what my bias is. When I sat across from Ron DeSantis, I pressed him. I pressed him on the weaknesses in his arguments, things that he said that were inconsistent, positions he had that would fall apart potentially if you really, you know, drilled down, and he stood his own. That's what a journalist does. That's what your obligation is as a member of the media. You failed, Rachel Maddow. You failed. I don't care how much they give you, $30 million a year. You're not worth 30 cents. That was an embarrassment. You fell down on the job, you embarrassed yourself and your network, and you ceded the entire discussion to a dishonest broker who set us down this disgusting path that we're now on, where everybody denies everybody's the real president. Shame on you both. And of course, it's not journalism, but if you watch MSNBC, you shouldn't expect journalism. It's not what they do there. They do punditry, they do propaganda. They are an arm of the DNC for all intents and purposes. That's what they do. They promote Democrats. We promote Republicans here at Explain America. They promote Democrats. It's what happens. Fox News promotes Republicans most of the time. MSNBC, a lot more extreme, in my opinion, in their fervor for Democrats. But what happened that night, I think, was disgusting. A former president got indicted, and it should have been treated a lot more seriously than it was. Folks, let me know what you think in the comments. Also, please remember to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps us out. I'm Carmine Sabia. This is Explain America. We love you guys. God bless you. Take care, everybody.